Alright all and welcome back to a new video which bookie followers and another anti-post selection for the Cheltenham 2022 festival. We finally started our anti-post portfolio and we started it off yesterday. Uh, if you haven't looked at that video please do check it out. A 50 to 1 shot for the Albert Bartlett and we're taking a dip into probably another strange enough market in the Mayor's Novices Hurdle this time round. And it is prudent to side with Willie Mullins in these sort of races, and I'm going to be doing so, but potentially not with what people would declare his first string, or potentially one that uh, people are really thinking of. And it's a mare called Brandy Love, who's currently available generally at 25 to 1, and I think that's just a big price for a mare that has considerable ability. Having won her point to point, she won a bumper at Ferry, is very impressively by 7.5 lengths, beating a Gavin Cromwell horse called Presenting New York. She looked a really, really classy filly that day and there was quotes for the champion bumper last year and looked like she might be going down that track. She was sent off 10 to 11 favoured for the Mayor's Bumper at the Dublin Racing Festival. We're slightly disappointing in coming third, but I don't think there was any disgrace in that performance when you look back at it. Grangie won the race from Party Central. Both have gone on to back those efforts up with graded company wins, uh, both at the Punchestown Festival at the back end of last year. And Party Central's already account opened her account over hurdles so far this year. She seemed to be the most well fancied of the Mullins lot that day and Patrick Mullins took the ride and considering Willie Mullins had four or five really quality mares in that field it's something to just bear in mind and something that we maybe have missed a trick in with this mare being 25 to 1. There are plenty of other quality mares in there in front of her in the market including L.A. Bell who's the favourite but you just have to be wondering especially in a race that Willie Mullins has dominated so much that this mare could well have been overlooked. And it's one of those, again, if she rocks up in a mare's maiden hurdle, even a general maiden hurdle, and wins first time up, she's going to be at least half that price of 25 to 1. So that's why I'm willing to get in there early. Fingers crossed that all's well and good with her at home, and if doing so, she could well transpire into being a graded filly at this time round. So therefore, Brandy Love, a 25 to 1 for the mare's novices hurdle, looks a pretty decent price.